Hi, this is Elizabeth. I am um, doing a video for day three on the book. So this video is going to show you a couple of different exercises that you can do that um, are going to help strengthen your diaphragm. So the very first one is probably the hardest. I like to start with the hardest because that way you can get it out of the way. So you start with your hands behind your head, if you can. If you have shoulder problems, do this with your arms down by your side or resting on your stomach. So you'll start off, hands behind your head. You will use your diaphragmatic breathing, okay? So it's very important that you use your diaphragm correctly in these exercises. You wanna breathe in through your nose, pushing your stomach out, and then exhale down. And then inhale as you come back up and exhale back down. Last one, inhale up, exhale down. And then inhale back up and let your arms down. Shake them out just a little bit. They might feel a little stiff. Now you wanna do um, something to just loosen up your shoulders. So we'll do forward and backward shoulder rolls. So you're gonna go forward, up and around. One, three, five. Now we're gonna go the opposite direction. So the important thing about shoulder rolls, I would do these every single day. And the reason why is because you want to loosen up all of your muscles up here so that your lungs can expand further when you breathe. If you're really tight up here, you're not gonna be able to expand these lungs. So you wanna do this every day when you get up, you wanna just try to loosen this, this area up, okay? And you're gonna have a better day breathing just doing that. Um, so after the shoulder rolls, we'll do a little bit of a neck stretch just because you're loosening all this up. So just lean your right ear to your right shoulder very gently. If this hurts, don't do it. Do it about five to 10 seconds and then raise your head back up and over. And back up. All right. Now. We'll do something called open and close. Once again, you're gonna need to focus on your diaphragm here. So start off with your arms together. You're gonna inhale through your nose, pushing your stomach out as you open your arms. So you wanna go and then exhale. Inhale, open. Exhale. Open. If at any time you need to let your arms down to rest, please do that. You can always pause this video and then go right back. Good. Now, put your hands on your shoulders and you're gonna do elbow rolls. This again, it's just gonna loosen you up a little bit. I would say do five to ten one direction. I'm going to do five and then change directions. All right, good. Okay, now the next one is called stirring the pot. So you really need to pay attention to your diaphragm. Once again, I'm going to keep saying that. Start off with your hands together. You're gonna inhale through your nose as you go around halfway in a big circle. And then exhale on the way back. Now notice, I'm using my whole torso, not just my arms, okay? So um, don't just use your arms, use the whole thing. You'll kinda go in a circle like this. Okay, so we'll do them together. Start off here, inhale, exhale. 
inhale. And now listen, if your inhales and exhales, if they're at a different speed than mine, that's fine. Do your speed, don't do mine, okay? Just make sure that you do five of these in one direction. You do not have to keep pace with me. Now we're gonna change direction. So we're gonna go the opposite way. Inhale. Number three. One more. Inhale and exhale. Good. Now, we just have one more today, okay? Now, this one is just a nice calming relaxation just to get your air in, your CO2 out, make you feel really good, okay? So, start off with hands down, and then you're going to reach out and above your head as you inhale. And then you're going to exhale, push it down. We'll just do this three times. Inhale. You can leave and look up if you want to. Exhale, and then one more, one big breath, and exhale. Awesome job. So you can do this video once a day, twice a day, five times a day. This video is great to do anytime you feel tired or if you're feeling short of breath, don't do the video at all, okay? If you're having a bad breathing day, don't do this. You just want to do your diaphragmatic breathing. That's it. Okay. Um, until next time. Thanks.